Warning, this video is intended for a mature audience. You understand? Viewer discretion is advised. Yay! <laughs> All right, this is Billy Bob Tanley here, people, and this is a request from Ghetto Tunes, and it was uploaded by Saber Spark, and the name this video is, What the Hell is Leo the Lion, the worst movie on Netflix? Okay, let's check it out. Yay. Oh, oh, it hurts. Oh, it hurts what so the much. hell is this? Oh, I think my baby's coming. You think your baby's coming? What the fuck? It's coming really fast. <laughs> What the hell was that? I don't know. You you had it blurred out. I couldn't really tell. It just heard sounds. I think it was one of the birth or something. is, without a doubt, one of the worst movies I have ever seen. I've and never heard of this. I've seen a lot of bad movies. Leo I've the seen Lion. Kiara the Brave. I've seen Mars Needs Moms. And I have seen Cargo. But Cargo. Leo the Lion is a special kind of awful. Oh, it is shit. this trifecta of garbage. Actually, it looks it's like more garbage and ass. We have an awful story. Yeah, that's not that's Simba. true. I'm a, how do you say, um, vegetarian. Yeah, awful you're a fucking animation. starving mom. <laughs> Awful voice acting. The heart of the jungle is closer than you think, my friend. You must embrace the feelings within so you can find your way. That's what you're I can do That's better voice acting than that for a damn turtle. Awful dialogue. I'm not a bloodthirsty lion. I'm apple juice thirsty. I'm apple juice thirsty. Ice coffee thirsty. With a little dash of soy milk. And Fuck this awful bitch. editing. Pussy lion. Little feminine cocksucker. Oh, it's a oh, knockoff oh, of the, oh, the Lion King. I mean, this thing has a 1.9 on IMDb, it was but on for Netflix. some reason has a 48% on Rotten Tomatoes. Yeah, yeah they don't it should know never been made. About. This movie is much worse than that. This film makes the Emoji Movie look like Toy Story. I'm no. A, vegetarian. I'll say a line that's I'm a vegetarian. That's just terrible. And like the title of the video says, this is also the worst movie on Netflix. Man, like, Netflix I really put Netflix. out that shit. You guys take a shotgun approach to content, but you guys can turn things down. Netflix, you're greenlit. Who am I speaking with? This movie was a challenge to research. I mean, it's kind of a mystery. Wow, you can't just exists. type in Leo the Lion on Google and have a Wikipedia page. Who you is this dig for? Than that. What is this At for first, me? I thought it was the Weinstein Company that made this film, but it turns out all they do is distribution. So I kept Shit digging, on this. and I found out that the company responsible for this film is some Italian company called Dujas Film. According Dujas to their Dujas website, film. they popped up in 2005. The article goes on to say that the first film from the company would be La Storia de Leo. So, La Leo Storia de Leo. Okay. Garbage. I have man. no idea when this movie was exactly made. One source don't says tell you on 2006. Another source says 2004. But the we article on their homepage was published in 2005. He's on a giant dick. And it arrived space. in America in 2013. So, uh... No one knows when this film was made. Actually, I don't care. what I suspect You're on a banana. is that no In one space. wants to claim this film. It never happened. What most likely happened Sounds like is it. that the Weinstein Company picked up this film for distribution and redubbed it in English in 2013. Did Why? any of you watch this trash? I don't know. This film actually looks like Sin. I mean, the original Sin the that fuck? caused the fall of man. How are you showing that? But hey, whatever. Bring it on. Let's put it on Netflix. I mean, yeah, uh. it looks like early 2000 trash, and there might yeah, be serial commercials with better animation. But hey, it's for kids. Oh, so they won't no, it's care. not for kids. Peppers, avocados, honey, dew, and citrus fruit. I eat a lot of beans, even though they make me toot. So this movie's origins, in a nutshell, is an Italian company made a Fuck shitty movie, movie back in 2005. It got picked up by the Weinstein Company in 2013, and somehow found its oh. way to Netflix. Ah! Well, Netflix likes to put on the garbage. Ah! No. The hell of this film. Ah, God, don't look at me like that. All right, let's talk about the movie. So we got the Weinstein Company logo, and then boom, there it is. Leo the Lion. Leo the Lion. 
And the people responsible for it. And he started off with his first person view. And there's a rainbow in the background. Give us the lowdown. So I'm going to try to send a message. Unlike the other cubs within his pride, was a vegetarian. Off the bat, yeah. I can already see a thousand things to criticize. First Go off, ahead. there's like four, five males in this pride. Yep, That's I see not it. how lions work. But then a bunch I of males, realized big pack. that this kind of critique is the least of my worries. There are much <laughs> bigger things to be concerned about. I'm hungry. Are we going to hunt any banana trees today? So it's established oh that God. Leo is a vegetarian, but his mom's trying to change and that. You're See? getting older now, Leo. Far too old for bananas. Today Sounds I'm like they're trying to, to send a message. A more an agenda. And so it down people's throats. One of the most epic chase scenes of all time. <sighs> Fuck this film. Or whatever the hell this is. Got a pussy feminine line. That's a vegetarian. We're waiting. Yeah, we're waiting for what? They're just running. Oh my god, it's still going. Lazy to something actually happens. His mother dies and falls off a waterfall. Oh, instead of that, it's the mother this time. Wow. Okay, she knocked her brains out. His we'll mother tells him to search it. out the heart of the jungle and that he'll be safe there, even though he's with a lion pride, which he should probably stay with. Do you even know why it's called a pride, Leo? <laughs> I'm losing brain cells already from this shit. And hunting makes us proud. <laughs> hey! But you don't like hunting. You don't like meat. You're just weird. Ah, uh, poor Leo is. He likes Whoa. his Whoa. soy salad. Who, oh. Who's this guy? I you don't, don't have to eat meat to make sure you don't go hungry. I know I sure didn't. Is is that There's... Leo? Why are we seeing Wait. this? Why is he old? So yeah, we find the out fuck? the narrator is actually a character, and he looks awful. What Quiet the fuck? Run! Uncle Ob, hey. That fellow you may have guessed is me. <laughs> so fucking precious. Oh no. Smile. Get that shit out of here, man. Yeah. Oh, I'm seeing a lot of fucked up stuff with this kid's Have film. Some respect for the elders of the forest. Beware my horns. You, you prepare to suffer the I'm already expecting Uncle some other things, too. Where is he? Beast. If you hadn't stopped me, I would have taught that lion a lesson, Leo. He thinks b b being a lion is all about b being big and tough and mean, but it's not. So the stuttering antelope is like Leo's friend or something. Boyfriend. We learned this from a flashback. We know they're going to be a couple. Ten seconds ago. Yes, that was Leo. Oh. Always saving my life back in those early days. Looking back now, it's easy to see that Leo was always the hero. He just had to find a way to believe it himself. This movie is a suddenly piece an elephant. of fucking shit. Okay. Oh my goodness. I'm going to be late for class again. So Leo meets the elephant, and they really hit it off. We find out that she's pregnant, and Leo tries oh to help. Oh my god, who cares? Please, I need you to hurry and get me to... Beatrice, the elephant doctor. We are then told how Savannah lost her husband. I had a husband. I don't care, you're Eli. a goddamn elephant! Eli Font. Eli Font. Yeah, I get the joke. <laughs> but a mighty Font. elephant is not so easy to catch without help. The helicopter drugs. And now you finally out of the way, old friend. I'll marry Savannah. <laughs> oh yeah, Elvis talking to you well like that. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this capturing of Eli Font is really interesting because it implies that Maximus the Elephant worked together with the poachers to get yeah, rid yeah. of Eli. That makes I a lot of sense. I had seen what the white elephant had done, but I kept it to myself. What? Watch her eyebrows uh -uh. here. And now? You'll never see our baby. There's this really Creepy. odd sexual tension between Leo and Savannah. No. I like having you here. But do you think Lines you could don't fuck elephants. So the Leo runs off to go get the doctor. An elephant doctor. One who went to medical school. I'm, uh, I don't want to imagine what... Medical school, no. Which means I'm terribly smart. Don't worry. She won't let you forget. Who's that? He must be our dad. 
Dad? Oh, Stop no, it. no, 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 no. I am not your dad. Now, excuse me while I lick your face. Also, uh, I've sure. heard this voice actor before. Because we want a mom and a dad. You don't want us? Oh, it's Debbie Derryberry, the voice of Jimmy Neutron. Oh, really? I didn't know that. The standard for research on these yeah, it matches reports. the voice. And then suddenly, a fire. So Leo has this brilliant idea to take these kids, who, by the way, aren't his, away from the jungle, across yeah. the desert, to a place that might not exist. This fucking pussy, man. This would be the perfect time to fight this, that's for sure. You know what? Nah, it makes sense. Go for it. No, it don't. Oh, okay, you got you know, that's pretty here. pretty evil, shooting at animals as they run from a fire. I can't find my What shirt. should we do? Maybe they started the fire. We must take her with us. She'll be safe in the heart of the jungle. And now there's a zebra. That's Who part of the D&D group. Followed by a monkey and then a cheetah, which none of them add anything to this film. They're just there. Nothing adds nothing. This film is shit. Okay, so it's officially time to meet the villain of this film, Maximus Elefante, who is voiced by Matthew Mercer. Uh, Elvis. That's right, the voice actor for McCree. I will find them. You know What's that on I'm your the biggest and strongest in the jungle. I'll bring them home. It's high noon somewhere in the world. Gaze upon my tusks, the main my villain dear. should have been a woolly mammoth who came out of the prehistoric times. Maybe a new king? My heart goes out to Matthew Mercer and all of the people who had to work on this film. It must have been a total drag. And here is the villain song, how much I got paid which for is just totally ripping off Be Prepared from The Lion King. All the way down that to is the not no scar at all. Hyenas. What the fuck? You, you fucking knock I off. Uh, <sighs> let's go with an elephant instead of a lion. Why well, couldn't it just be a giant Siberian tiger or something? Not an elephant. <laughs> Put a T Rex there. That's a good the final boss. <sighs> no. Wow. I'm they just had to knock it off, didn't nobody. they? Hmm. So sometimes these weird pseudo songs pop up. They don't really make any sense, and it's you know what you look like? like you look like a Thelma from Scooby Doo. Who needs Are you that? related to her? You gather all your friends, you muster all the strength within. And if you're not so strong, <laughs> just grin and sing this song. Oh, God. Snake. Forever, with an ice cream. Together, not apart. Sing it, kid. <laughs> Pizza shit. Wishes you were dead. So if you actually watch <laughs> this movie, you'll notice these weird parts where That's there's Baker, the slow motion. But it's not real slow motion. It's like taking a piece of footage and stretching Ugh. it out. And they do it throughout the entire movie. It's because it's garbage, man. The stupid oh, pussy oh, like I hate these weak ass bitches. It's okay, it's okay. Keep your eyes forward. Uh, Good, there you go. That's the stuff. Soy lime nice protagonist, work. man. Okay, keep going. Not masculine Jesus. at all, not cool at all, not tough. Easy, you're okay. You're okay. Okay, good. Good. This insufferable chatter between the baby elephants is just Ugh, uh, fingers on a chalkboard. Yeah, Korean. That's the word you're looking for. It's okay. It's okay. I hate this line. So Leo falls <laughs> okay. and the kids move on without him. Then Maximus Elefante Bonnie, gets shot in his ass. <laughs> <laughs> I got, oh, now you got shot in the ass. Or his ass too. So Leo survives his fall. I know, it's a bummer. And meets some turtle, turtle inside a cave. This turtle is actually the worst character in the movie. Like, seriously, listen. I consider traveling, but where would I go? What would I do? What was that saying my great ancestor used to say all Kill the time? It. What was it? Oh, yes. Uh, Age is but a pebble yeah. compared to the pearl of Freeze a death oh, ball. Oh, so bad. Oh, and it is suddenly fire. hyenas. This lion has nerve. He's Where? going to be in our derb. They actually added the hyenas. Sky. I'm going to make vulture pie. <laughs> now we need Scar. So these hyenas kind of rhyme, and they also sound very racist towards Mexicans. <laughs> what? Stay back, they're our hyenas chase the vultures through space. Back off before we go loco. <laughs> hey, our malnourished hero has returned. I'm 
sure somebody got offended by that. Because everybody wants to get offended. Even at stereotype jokes, you can't do that anymore. During this fight scene, they used the same footage huh. twice for the zebra. Huh. Did it again. Meanwhile, Maximus is tripping balls at the elephant graveyard. Oh, there's an elephant graveyard. Okay. It's him, the king. Who was that? I'm sorry. I betrayed the king. you. All right, so Savannah and the other elephants Weird. decide to go looking for her babies. But for some reason, they're dancing and singing while they're doing it. Okay, that's retarded. You all deserve to get shot. Do this stupid shit. What a terrible film. And it was on Netflix. What are you guys doing? Help me find my babies. Who put so that red thing on her Uncle forehead? Lope decide to hold down a zebra against her will and take her milk. <gasps> it's a lion. What are you doing here? Please don't eat me. <sighs> what the fuck are you doing? Now, uh, uh, oh. well, let's cool it down. It's kind of rapey. Wait, what who worked on this film again? Ah, oh, okay, that makes sense. In this Who's scene, that? she has no udders, but now she has them, and they're really detailed. So they finally find the heart of the I'm jungle. I'm about to just jump out of window, man. Can't... I hate this film. I hate food? this film. I eat. What? Just life-sustaining water? That sucks. While at the pool, there's this chameleon shaman there. Who now we got SBO. Doors will open. You'll go far. Just march along to your own drum. Sing a tune, hum your own hum. What? Leo finally overcomes his fear of water, which is kind of dangerous because I'm gonna assume he has no idea how to swim. And now you'll find the jungle's heart through courage. He just jumps most right in there. Art. I'm not afraid anymore. I'm free. I'm totally free. This fucking bitch the made line. The heart is within. Everyone, come I wish Simba would just show rainbow. up and kick his ass. <laughs> rainbow. Ho -ho. Rainbow magic. <laughs> Okay. Now we're in the jungle's heart. The courage, He's gonna go give him some dick. What did they say? Ah, uh, it's more know. breathtaking Don't than care. I ever imagined. And the shaman, quite the lady. Apparently, Uncle Lope likes the reptiles. Well, what about mummies? Huh? Can we oh, just shit. end this? Whole I forgot shit. about your mom. So Leo and the baby elephants start to go back to their home, but then Maximus shows up. Oh, he's still alive. Come along, little ones. Time to return you to mommy. And when I do, she will become my bride, <gasps> and I will become your mom. new daddy. That's right, you little punks. Get going. <laughs> <laughs> I never seen this guy. Slow down, we can't keep up. Stop, I'm not going any further. That right <sighs> there was not the original voice actor. If either no. of you say anything about what just happened, I guarantee I will end your mother's life. And when I'm done with her, Leo will be next. And where what will that fuck? leave you, little orphans? Hmm? Well, she. Wow, that's uh, kind of dark. If you tell your mom, I'll kill her. And then you guys will be next. So Savannah wow. finally arrives, and Leo tries to tell her the truth. I thought you were our friend, but you're nothing more than a vicious, deceitful fiend who's going to eat my baby. Really? Don't be upset. Wait, you believe this guy? Not <laughs> even going to ask any questions here? All right, so not, Savannah no believes bitch. Maximus and takes off back to the jungle. But the then Maximus villain. tries to kill Leo, but kills Uncle Lope instead, which is totally fine what by me. What the fuck? No! Killed Uncle, Uncle Lope. Uh, 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 uh. Wow. Uncle Lope dies. Am I supposed to cry or something? Wow. They are really ripping off the Lion King. Help! Kind of are you. Somebody! 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 Help! Yep, there it is. It's, yeah. Somebody! They had to just. Why, why the Lion King? So we have this flashback of moments throughout the movie. Great flashback. This movie is ass and trash. Could you imagine if they did this in The Lion King for Mufasa? Would've been dumb. 
Uh, Mufasa and Simba should be very pissed off. Wow. <laughs> that seems familiar. The two of you, I just don't know. I think we need some magic here. Uncle Lope, I send you hope. Now face your fate and That's a little come creepy. awake. Whoa. Wait, so he was sleeping? Uh, okay, of course. so the flashback was pointless. Mind you, we went from the jungle to the heart of the jungle, what which dumb isn't shit. even in the jungle, and now we are going back to the jungle. Well, you know what? Whatever. It's wedding time. Just, but just Leo up. shows up to stop Maximus. He, he, King Eli Font's disappearance was no accident. That night, Maximus crept up behind Eli and betrayed the king know? by making sure he was captured by outsiders. Ah! Rawr. You? Now watch this. The ink on her head just disintegrates. What? I don't get that. That's weird. This is all your fault, you vegetarian lion! <sighs> so an epic shit. battle commences between Maximus and Leo that soon devolves <laughs> into a chase scene from Scooby Doo. <laughs> I hate Leo. Little pussy. No. Where'd he come from? Who is this helicopter? Not again. Oh no. Rest in peace. Okay. And that was the last anyone heard Stupid from battle. Maximus Elefante. That's right. He was captured by the poachers, and his tusks were cut off and sold on the Chinese black market. <laughs> so we reach the end of this movie, Dale. and the babies, Leo and Savannah, are all together and happy. Thanks for believing in me, Savannah. How and can these I ever up. thank you, Leo? He enjoyed playing with the young ones whenever he could. <laughs> he taught them about life. He also taught them about love. We go oh. back to Elder Leo to show telling his class about the story. Maximus was captured, and no longer was any bullying allowed in the jungle. There's that always going to be a, a bad guy to, the to take the bad guy's place. Your mother was really grateful. Stop! Oh my god. They actually f***ed. Leo the lion <laughs> and Savannah the elephant <laughs> had sex. And, and they had those these babies? are the outcome. Sounds like <laughs> a green burning hell. Yep. You, oh, <laughs> I didn't think they do that shit. And to wrap things up, we got half one elephant, more line. song, and it's about Leo being a vegetarian. I don't I'm care. Vegetarian. You're gonna, I'll you just pissed again, off a lot yes, of people, I'm man. This is shoving bullshit down people's throats. I'm a pussy, a feminine pussy. Huh. Course, be I'm frank. A <sighs> right, I thought finally, this was going to end him having a, a male boyfriend. Glory. A special thanks to Cardio for his Stupid. patience. Stupid. Buddy, you Stupid. better be thanking the entire audience for their patience. <sighs> there couldn't have been an audience for this shit. <sighs> worst okay. movie on that. Or now one of the worst. You all know what we're dealing with and what this movie is about. So just let's garbage. go back to the pentagram. One. Animation. The character models, their faces, Looks their movement, like their textures, box. all garbage. Like, it's truly horrendous how bad this quality is. Slow down! Elephants weren't made for speed! I learned that in medical school, and an elephant never forgets! You went to Number medical two, school? The story. This thing is all over the place. It's inconsistent, it's a it knock lacks off focus, of the line, King. and the characters are so unpleasant. Oh, <laughs> Oh, water. And you had Get to have a water. pussy Perfect. protagonist. A herd of kumquats. Something I cannot Come stand. Come Come Can't stand it in games or movies. Oh, hey, good looking. Number three, the voice acting. This is the least offensive part of the movie. Like, they had some good actors Terrible. on this film, but they were poorly directed. They come across as a nuisance, annoying, and insincere. And cringe. And I have and I things to talk about. Older you get, wiser you get. What was that saying my ancestors used to say all this the time? This movie is Age dicks. Age is not a pebble compared to the pearl of wisdom. Number four. 
editing. There are scenes that go on for far too long. There this are movie scenes went on that for are too way long. too fast. And there are scenes that are stretched out and aren't actually slow motion. Whenever I see these scenes, it takes me out of the movie. Yes, the hyena should last Leo. longer. Always saving my life back in those early days. Looking back now, it's easy to see that Leo was always the hero. Leo and looks like he weighs at least dialogue. maybe 30 pounds. There are moments Pick when the up. characters say the something is... that I can't even understand. Because, Leo, they smell your scent. What? But I wore deodorant. <sighs> Not funny. Yeah, it's trash. In Throw conclusion, it in this is the worst movie on Netflix by a long shot. One of the worst. I mean, There's no there such thing as the worst. There might be some little kids who might enjoy it because it has bright colors and has movement. But by that comparison, yeah, little kids dangling keys don't in front of good somebody stuff is, is a much shit. better film. <laughs> I realize that there's some films out there that they're so bad that they're good. But this is not that. Leo the Lion is just trash. So do yourself a favor. And I and never watch it. No, I ain't going to. Vegetarian. So there you go, everyone. If y'all want to watch the original video, the link is in the description. Go check it out and shit. Getting the fuck out here. So yeah, my name is Billy Bob Tanley, and I approve this message.